I'm James Albert with Troll Music and Trollmusic.com here with Thorson Moore, local and national guitar legend. He's playing my 74 SG with Seymour Duncan and Tick Woody pickups in it, and he's going to be trying out the Diamond Positron amp for the first time. Let's see how it goes. Thorson? Okay. So what is this thing, James? It is an amplifier made by Diamond called the Positron. Right on. It's uh, basically it's a two knob tone and volume amp, simple, effective. About uh, I think it's like, it peaks like 28 watts, but it averages around 18 to 20 watts. Single 12 cabinet, Celestion in it. So yeah, fire the bitch up. Let's hear it. Go. Let's see tone. I'll put it flat. How's oh, a good volume for the microphone there? Should be, should be fine. That's on two. Yeah, it's class A, so. So the thing is well, there's certain points where it stops getting louder and stop starts breaking up just because okay. you reach kind of peak of it. Okay, cool. It's, yeah, it's hard with my ear right yeah. in front of it, but Check the different tone range to see where else you can go with that. Yeah, right now I got the tone on like what six and a half and volume on six and a half, so yeah, put tone on the top, see how, how much you cut your head off. Alright, let's do that. Yeah. Especially if you're using like a reverb, you know, on a pedal yeah. or something. And it's like you're spending a lot of money on a guitar with expensive woods and all these expensive hand wired special pickup. Uh, this guy, it's like all of a you're plugging in an amp with like that's all digital. You're like, what the hell am I doing this for? You know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right, put tone in zero. Put tone like one. See that does. Right. Put it on one. Bring it back because I can't stand low tone with the loud volume. Super. Oh, uh, I think it's actually like a seventy-three silver phase. Yeah. Oh, how do you think? Compared, like brutal honesty, super tone compared to the diamond, and like what's plus or minuses? Well, I mean the speakers are different and everything too. Um, you know, the, I, I would have a hard time comparing the two. Yeah. You know, because this seems to have a lot more power, and um, you know, as far as you know. Than my amp, my, you know, mine kind of it's got, it's got four tens in it, and yeah. it, you know, breaks up pretty easy, and it's a great amp. I mean, I love it. I probably wouldn't play much else, but uh, but I don't know. I mean, really, I'd say this seems to have more of a martial feel to it to me. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. It has more of that kind of. 
you know, I don't know if that's the closed cabinet or, or the circuitry it's or what. It's kind of both. But, you know, I would love to have one of these, you know, hooked up with, you know, another small amplifier in stereo just maybe, to get, yeah. you know, maybe like, you know, this with maybe like more of a Fender style or something like that. Um, you know, it's, uh, it, it's killer, man. It sounds, it sounds awesome. You know, it's, it's nice on an amp. Do not British clone, basically. <laughs> yeah. That makes sense, yeah. So class A, and way cheaper than if you're going to get a Marshall Class A amp, that's for sure. So those are like a couple thousand bucks now. Yeah, yeah, because, so. I mean, I've, I've always kind of stuck with what I have, you yeah. know, I just... We all have. We're so, all... You know, you probably actually know more about it than I do. Yeah, we're all pretty... Well, that's the whole point. I know that's what why, I hear. That's why we have you here, because, like, we're all kind of used to the different stuff a lot. And yeah. you've been playing this, your same rig because you have your tone figured out already. Mm -hmm. It's kind of nice that... Someone who has their, their their ears set to what they like and throwing something else at them, see how they approach it and say, well, it's like this, 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 and this compared to how I play. Then we can get more of like a, a secondary opinion. <laughs> well, well, what does this run? Yeah, the whole thing is like eight hundred bucks. It's like four ninety nine for the head, two ninety nine for the cap. Okay. So yeah, I mean, so you're looking at a usable small one twelve combo for right right eight nine hundred bucks out the door. Okay. You know, and again, it's Class A wiring, so you don't have any of that weird, will we put this chip in it? No, no. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah. Exactly. It's like the whole thing, you burn through tubes faster, but you get that tone immediately. There's no lag mm -hmm. presence that you get with the AB. The difference between this and some other amps is that once you reach a certain volume, it stops getting louder. It starts just breaking up more, which is weird, but cool. Yes. Yeah, I think pretty common, I think, with yeah. a lot of those. You know, amps. You know, that kind of happens in my super around six. You know, just kind of, and then you, you know, you can get a little bit more as soon as you hit eight, nine, ten. Just, so yeah, it's just full on. Yeah. You know, and I, and I actually like the natural sound of it, but you know, breaking up. But at times, I like to you know have a loud, clean sound, just depending on the gig and yeah. instead of switching amps and all that shit. You know, but whatever. Yeah. So yeah, this is the Diamond Positron. In the oh, sorry. <laughs> this is Thor with James Alfred and TrollMusic.com. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube page and, of course, like our like us on Facebook. Because the more we get, the more uh, the more we keep doing these videos, the more special guests we'll have. So you won't have to look at this ugly mug all the time. All right, catch you guys next time. Play us out, Thorson.